are going to look at the WHO classification. So the WHO classification of what of the ovarian WHO classification of the ovarian tumor. So to begin with some questions, the first question is what are the epithelial tumors? So what are the tumors coming under this category? The second question will be what are the germ cell tumors? The third will be what are the gonadoblastoma? So what comes under this? So we'll be answering all these questions in the video and we'll learn in detail. To begin with, we look at the epithelial cell tumors. So epithelial tumors. So one important thing to note is that this is the most common MC, most common, and the it includes the serous tumors, also the mucinous, the mucinous tumors. Next, it also includes the endometroid tumors, then the clear cells, the clear cells. Next, it also includes the Brenner's tumors, the Brenner tumors, the steromucinous, as well as the undifferentiated carcinoma. So, all these are included in the epithelial tumors. So next is the sex cord stromal tumors. So the sex cord stromal tumors. So what does the sex cord stromal tumors include? So it includes there is the pure stromal tumors. Pure stromal tumors. So what does this pure stromal tumors include? It includes the presence of fibroma, it includes the thecoma as well, and the ladic tumor. It includes the ladic tumor as well, the stercoid cell tumors. So it includes all these tumors. And then we also look at another category that is a pure cell cord, sex cord tumors. Pure sex cord tumors. So under the pure cut sex cord tumors, it includes the granulosa, the granulosa cell tumor. That is the adult and the juvenile. Then it also includes the Sertoli cell tumor. So after this, there is also the mixed sex cord. The mixed sex cord. That is a stromal tumors. So what does this include? It includes the Sertoli, Sertoli as well as the Leydig tumors. Now we'll be looking further at the germ cell tumors. So what are the germ cell tumors? So under the germ cell tumors, we look at the dis germinoma so this germinoma is present then also the endodermal sinus tumor so the endodermal sinus tumor is nothing but the yolk sac the yolk sac tumor then we also look at the embryonal carcinoma the embryonal carcinoma then also the poly embryoma then comes the non gestational choriocarcinoma choriocarcinoma then the teratoma as well that is it can be mature or immature now we also look at the mixed forms then we look at another category the gonadoblastoma so this uh, gonadoblastoma this includes the pure 
it includes the category pure the other category is nothing but mixed it is mixed and mixed with the dysterminoma so it is mixed with the dysterminoma or the other germ cell tumors germ cell tumors so the other categories include the soft tissue tumors and this is non specific to the ovary so this is one next there are also some uh, miscellaneous tumors there are a uh, secondary there are secondary that is the metastatic tumors lastly there is also the tumor like conditions the tumor like conditions so now we'll be answering our questions so here we are going to answer two questions so the first question was the epithelial tumors so the important point here is uh, we need to know it is the most common so what are the tumors under it there is the serous the serous tumors the mucinous tumors as well as the endometrial endo metroid endometrial tumors then there is also the clear cell the clear cell is also present then there is the brenner's tumor also the brenner's tumor so brenner's tumor there is a transitional cell tumors tct and there is a seromucinous and the undifferentiated carcinoma next we look at the germ cell tumors so what does this germ cell tumor contain so under the germ cell tumor this was the second question we asked this contains the there is uh, the dysterminoma also the dysterminoma is present here then there is also the endodermal the endodermal a sinus tumor also present sinus tumor so this is nothing but the yolk sac tumor next we have the embryonal carcinoma the embryonal carcinoma then the poly embryoma there is also the non gestational the non gestational chorio carcinoma then also the teratoma that is it can be mature as well as the immature then we have the mixed forms so now we'll be answering now we'll be asking our bonus questions so here you can answer these bonus questions in the comments so the first question we want to ask is name the sex cord stromal tumors so what falls under this sex cord stromal tumors the second question is what is what are under the gonadoblastoma what type of tumors you can answer them in the comments Oh, 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 oh,